Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and to another video where today I'm going to go and watch my team, Clothero FC, as they take on Ramsbottom United away from home in the FA Trophy. Now, last time out on the channel, um, I was at Ramsbottom uh, for their league game against Macclesfield FC, which Macclesfield won convincingly 5-0, despite me predicting in the introduction that it would be quite a tight game based on the, uh, the evidence of the games that I've seen from Macclesfield this season but yeah probably shouldn't do score predictions now on the channel sort of based on on the last few I've done going horribly wrong but anyway um, looking to today's game obviously FA Trophy game um, great competition you know in the last round I said it's a competition that Clitheroe are going to want to go far in and I think they can um, you know if they win today against Ramsbottom they get to the first round proper which would be great you know another good cup run for the club but um, all focus really I think for Clitheroe you know they're going to take this game seriously but I think the main focus is on the league and also the FA Cup game coming up uh, next Saturday against Bury. Um, you know, it's a tie that, that I think Clitheroe can progress from. You know, no disrespect to Bury, they've had a great FA Cup run so far. Uh, a lot of you guys watching the channel uh, will be Bury fans. You know, I've covered you a few times on the channel and, you know, I, I wish you all the best. But um, I, I think that is a game that Clitheroe can can win considering there's there's a league difference between the two sides but yeah that's for next Saturday um, not to worry about today um, you know all focus today is on the FA Trophy and yeah I, I think this is a game that Clothero can win um, you know Ramsbottom haven't looked great this season Clothero have already beaten them 2-0 at home in the league See, I'd like to think Clothero can probably edge edge through this game and, and progress in the FA Trophy, and, and hopefully they do. Should be a, a good game. You know, it's always a good game between Clothero and Ramsbottom. They've played out some great ties, um, you know, against each other in the league and stuff in the past. So, yeah, hoping for a good game. Hoping that Clothero progress as well, and we'll see you when we get down there. <laughs> at the uh, Harry Williams Stadium uh, a bit early as usual um, but I've just seen that today obviously I'm filming highlights for the club I'm gonna be up there in the gantry so uh, looking forward to that <laughs> been on worse to be fair but yeah um, yeah not looking forward to having to go up there
I'm here at the Harry Williams Stadium and it's currently Ramsbottom United 1, Clitheroe 2 and um, yeah, Rami started the, uh, the first half the better side, um, took the lead on the 22nd minute but uh, Clitheroe responded really quickly, um, Billy Priestley heading home from a corner uh, to put us back on level terms and then uh, it seemed like the half was going to peter out and um, we're going to go in level at the break but uh, Sefton Gonzalez uh, right at the end of the half um, from a corner uh, was cleared and then crossed back in and Sefton Gonzalez put it away at the far post. So yeah, positive half for Clithero, uh, leading at the break, hopefully can see this one out. Only negative so far is the uh, injury to Terry Cummings. Um, not quite sure what he's done, but um, hopefully it's just a precaution that he's gone off and uh, it's not too serious and he'll be back in action. Enough, but yeah, um, positive half for Clitheroe, like I said, leading at the break. But um, we'll see how this one goes, and hopefully we can see it through and, and progress to the uh, to the next stage of the FA Trophy. But yeah, we'll see you guys on the other side at full time. <laughs>
Okay, back in the car now after the game. Uh, I'm absolutely freezing from being stood up on that gantry, but uh, what a second half that was from Clitheroe. Uh, the game finished 4-1 to the Blues. Um, yeah, brilliant second half. Uh, Clitheroe really, really stepped it up. Um, goals in the second half from uh, Sefton Gonzalez, who was really, really unlucky not to have a hat-trick. Um, he had a chance sort of near the end. Um, would have been a hat-trick of headers as well, I think, if he'd uh, put that one away. But yeah, he was brilliant today. And then um, the fourth goal came from uh, Reese Webb Foster, who, um, yeah, ball fizzed across the box and uh, he scrambled it home for the fourth. But yeah, great, great performance from Clothero that um, showed really, really good character to come from behind. Um, and, and yeah, through to the next round of the FA Trophy. So brilliant afternoon all round. Um, Clitheroe are on another cup run as well into the, um, the first round proper of the FA Trophy. So yeah, it's just a great feeling around the club at the moment. Um, and they've uh, got the FA Cup next weekend, um, Lancashire Cup on Tuesday, but I do suspect they'll put out a um, quite a weakened side for that game in order to um, to rest the uh, the first teamers for what is a absolutely huge game on Saturday at Shawbridge in the FA Cup against um, Bury AFC. You know I spoke about it in the introduction, but um, you know the club could make history on Saturday if they get a win. And um, we'll see you there. Uh, I've got a game on Tuesday. Not quite sure where I'm going yet, but um, I will be at the FA Cup game. Uh, next week so yeah really really looking forward to that one great day today as well um, seeing Clothero progress in the FA Trophy so yeah if you guys have enjoyed the video please do not forget to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on so you never miss an upload thank you so much for watching once again and I will see you in the next one